What a great message from the First Lady about staying fit and healthy. And you know, Missy, there's no better way to do it than a tennis court. <laughs> you know, Q, the pool still gives me a pretty good workout. But what I love about tennis is it's so easy to play anywhere and has been sized right just for kids. So let's go down to the court where Nickelodeon star Jeff Sutphin is hanging out with some great young players. Ah, uh, thanks, guys. You know, the First Lady was asking me earlier, Jeff, how do you stay in such great shape? And I'm like, Tennis, of course. God, we got some really great players who actually train right here at the Billie Jean King Center. I want to introduce them to you. Please welcome to the court, Aman Sharman. How about a hand for Gabby Price? There she is, Rachel Arbitman. And last but not least, Logan Chang. All right, these four players are going to play the classic game, Beat the Pro! I was really hoping you guys were going to join me on that one. No big deal, I got it. All right, all we need now is a pro. Hold on, let me just uh, dial up the pro store. Yeah, hi, could you guys please send to center court stat one Novak Djokovic, please? Yeah, I'll take one of those. Bring him on out. There he is. What's going on, right, man? Right. Are you ready for this? I'm absolutely ready. All right, simmer down. It's not going to be a cakewalk for you, Mr. World Number One, because we're playing with size right equipment to level the playing field. We got the smaller rackets, the balls. We're going to show off this new technology, and these guys are going to give you a run for your okay. money. You ready? All right, go I'm get ready. the ready position. Let me explain the rules. Here's what's going to happen. You guys are each going to get one minute to score as many points on the pro as you can. I'll tell you who's going. I'll tell you when your time is up. At the end of the game, whoever's got more points will be the winner and take over number one world ranking. No pressure. All right, Aman, you're up first. Aman is uh, in the fourth grade. He likes to read sometimes, he told me. Oh. His biggest pet peeve oh. is tennis players who wear blue shirts and white shorts. All right. Same side or switch? Don't ask the questions. You just play tennis, all right? Here. Here we go. Mom means business. That looks like a good serve to me. Wow, this loud. Here it comes. Finish it! Oh. Yeah! Bring in the heat, Amon, ladies. He is single. He is single. One more point. Here we go. I, Your minute's running out. Get one more point in before the buzzer. No emotions, huh? He means business. He does. Sorry. Sorry, I don't want to talk. Nice serve. Nice serve. Wow. Wow. Next up is Gabby. Come on, nice job. Are you ready? Yeah. Gabby's in the fifth grade. She also likes gymnastics. Her specialty is the backflip. Watch out for that. Oh, his knees are shaking. <laughs> oh, oh, no back good. Finish it! Oh. Yeah! Three to one, the kids lead. Gabby told me earlier she's going to make no, uh, Djokovic wow. wish he never picked up a racket. Uh, she told me that. One I'm second, not one second, this one up. second. Let me get a few breaths. Towel! Don't give him his breath. Keep working him. Nice serve, Gabby. Whoa! Uh. Yeah! Four to one, kids. Rachel, you are up. Nice job, Gabby. Thank you very much, Rachel. Let's bring the heat. What am I doing wrong here? Yeah, dude, you're getting, you're getting worked. Uh, Rachel is a fifth grader. Fine. Uh, and in case you're wondering, yes, she plays the saxophone. Doesn't matter, keep going. Shake it off, shake it off. It's fine, it's fine. Oh my God. Give her some encouragement, guys, come on. What? There we oh. go, Rachel. There it is. 
Yeah. One more serve. Rachel wanted me to thank her family. She says they support me every day, even when I'm losing. But she's doing great here today. Nice serve. We call that one the meatball. Uh oh, he's up on the net. Don't let it get to you. Put it down his throat. Yeah! Down the line! Six to one! All right, Logan. You're up, Logan. Here wow. we go. Logan's in the sixth grade. He's been playing for a mere three years. I'm right here. Look at me. I'm waiting. Okay, that's good. Oh, it's okay, it's okay. I'd also I'm like here. to personally thank Logan for having the easiest name for me to pronounce. I'm looking in your direction, Novak. Oh. There it is. Oh. Oh. Wait, where did those balls come from? I think they came from up there. That is uncalled for. I'll make sure that does not happen again. Seven to one, kids lead. Seven Logan, to one, one more. Give us, give us the good stuff. Oh my God. Oh, uh, this looks like it's going to be an easy eight-one uh, here. Uh, uh, <laughs> uh, 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 oh, last point. It's good from where I'm standing. The kids win eight to one. The new world champions. Well, as you just saw with size right equipment like these new tennis balls for kids, you can play tennis anywhere with anyone, even the number one player in the world. They're easier to control. So before you know it, you're gonna be painting the baseline with awesome winners. For all the information, log on to utennis.com. Take it away, Jeff. Thanks, guys. Uh, you know, you, you guys did a great job. It reminded me of that time I was schooling Federer. What did you guys think about uh, taking on this guy? It was really easy. Come on, you should have played hard on us. He said it was easy. Uh, how are you feeling? I mean, you came in here number one. Now you're fifth. Um, well, I have to be satisfied with the fifth place, and I have to say I underestimated my opponents today. The, the scary thing is, as he was warming them up backstage. Bet you're regretting that. Yes. Wow. I am. There's more great music and, of course, tennis action right after the break. 